What a beautiful day. Yeah. I love this. This is the life. It's like we didn't have anything to do today. Just lay around. We don't. Our shell. We just lay around, right? Yeah. We get to do that, right? Yeah. Uh, wait a second. Is today the new Liberation living room? No, oh, it's gonna be. No, I think it's right now. No, I would have remembered. I think we're missing it. No, get it. Are you Come serious? on, we're late. Are you serious? Again. <laughs> Sometimes dreams come true Oh, I know because I have you You're my morning flower, my blue sky too Golden starlight, I love you Heaven's hand scatters Seed. Today's promise for tomorrow's need To watch you laugh and watch you play The love you give steals my heart away How many times I think of you and always wish you well Like counting dreams in the night Too many to tell I'll rock you easy and hold you tight Slow and easy Everything is all right Close your eyes And close them tight And the dream man will weave you A dream tonight Sometimes 
dreams come true Oh, I know Cause I have you You're my morning flower My blue sky too Golden starlight I love you I just want to ask you a few questions, no really, about what you do and what you think about when you're playing. Um, I guess one would be, do you think that everybody can create? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. I think it's innate, kind of just natural, I think. I think we all have a desire to, one way or the other, no matter what we're doing. So. Yeah. How long have you been doing this? Yeah, I've been playing guitar since teenager, like around 13. and. In various forms, you know, whether rock or whatever, just kind of, uh, just, I don't know, I can't put it down. Yeah, what well, did you start, uh, in the beginning, did you start um, with um, what you're doing now, or did you start with, like, different styles, or? Oh, yeah, I mean, I've changed a lot, probably more, like, more, just, I was more interested in, like, rock in the beginning, when I started playing, I was a Jimi Hendrix. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Love Hendrix and all that kind of thing, and, uh, um, and then the, I don't know. Then like maybe my twenties kind of got interested in like folk type stuff and mm -hmm. some classical guitar, and so just kind of all over the place. Oh, that's beautiful. Or, Who would you say are some of your people that you've listened to that you really feel have influenced your style at this point? You know, like I love like some of the old country blues stuff. Like I've, I mean, I've played some of like the country blues tunes, like John Hurt and. Um, Oh, just various blues artists. Uh, and I also think, like, I, I've read a lot of poetry, like, by Langston Hughes. Mm -hmm. I think, um, yeah. in, a, in a funny way, that kind of influenced me a lot. That's a great rhythm. Yeah, yeah. Beautiful, yeah, I love that. Um, and since we're in the liberation living room, I guess, uh, how do you define liberation? Mm -hmm. I think freedom. Um, freedom for anything that hold you back anything that's negative you know that's um yeah it's freedom it's for going forward yeah it's um uh no entanglements that's great all right well i think now what we're going to do because they're getting restless <laughs> now what we're going to do is we're going to turn over some questions to the audience who has some questions raise your hand if you have a question absolutely wait um hmm Looks like there's uh, somebody right up here in the front, this uh, guy with the crazy brown hair and Hi. a bow tie. My name's Abe Lincoln. Hello. Uh, I'm Abe Lincoln. Uh, actually, my friend the turtle over here has a question. He's kind of nervous. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh, yeah, you said you wanted to ask him a question. Okay. Um, when you make a song, mm -hmm. what comes first? The music or the words? With me, most most times it's probably the music. Then I kind of, probably the music, but sometimes I like kind of start with an idea and maybe I start with some kind of idea that I want to kind of put down and maybe kind of vague, then I'll just maybe fool with the music. Then, um, and the words last. Okay, yeah. That's cool. Does anybody, what, what do you got? Um, do you play anything else besides the guitar? Oh, I, I tried the piano, but I was, I was not that good at it. <laughs> it's pretty bad. Do you know when bugs collect food in the summer or winter? When birds collect food in the summer or winter? That's a really good question. Oh. Tyrone, you? Um, I think all year round. I think they have to eat. 
every day. So <laughs> yeah, they, they got to store it up for the winter. So oh, I'm so glad glad you asked yeah. that. That's... Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, sorry. We got a chicken oh. up front. Do you take um, guitar lessons? I used to. I could probably still use some. <laughs> <laughs> we all yeah. We all. <laughs> Are there any more questions? Oh, we got another chicken. What do you got? Um, um, I forget. Okay. <laughs> oh, another chicken question. Do you have one? What instruments are how many? Which instruments and how many instruments are in this band? Your band. One, two, four million, five million. A lot. We have uh, seven today. Yeah. Oh, what instruments? Um, well, maybe we'll go around real quick and have people introduce themselves. So. I'm Carly, and I sing. Hi. I'm Craig, and I play guitar. I'm Tony, and I play bass. I'm Chris, and I play the bass. My name's Mike, I play the drums. My name's Steve, I play the bass clarinet. I'm Jacob and I was playing uh, xylophone and flute and be playing tenor a little later. And I'm Tyrone and I play the guitar and sing. All right, so here we go. We're taking uh, Tyrone Cotton uh, Dreams and we're gonna um, play, it as a, play it a different way. All right, you ready?
Tyrone, beautiful, amazing, soulful. Yes. I could listen to him all day. Me too. Great storyteller. Yeah, he's great. I feel like I've been transported right now. Yeah, yeah. Hey, um, Jacob, listen. Yeah. I gotta ask you something. It's mm -hmm. kind of a personal question. Do you uh, mind? It's okay. I don't want to hurt your feelings or anything. But, uh, why is your band called Liberation Prophecy? I mean, those are nonsense words, right? You just made them up. And, you know, why, why not name your band, like, Super Bear or Handsome Bear or Genius Bear or something like that? But, yeah, Liberation Prophecy, it's a big name, of course, yeah. man. But we thought it was beautiful. So, basically, prophecy is kind of saying something that's going to happen in the future. Yeah, yeah. Like a prediction? Like a prediction, yeah. Like, all human beings are going to live in peace. Wow. I or, mean, uh, that's like, a beautiful thing. One day, I will catch all the salmon. That's a beautiful thing. Yeah. One day. Well, what about the other word? Liberation. Well, liberation is an interesting word, uh -huh. but one, one way you can do it is you can break it down a little bit. So, what other word does liberation sound like? Um, like, uh, liberal? Yeah, man, liberal, perfect. Like, I'm going to put a liberal amount of jam on my toast. Absolutely, man. You're gonna free that jam from the jar. Yeah, that's right. Free jam. Free jam. <laughs> that's Perfect. Whoa, well, that's what I'm talking about. That's what it's all about. That visionary, Jacob. Yeah, send that jam to a violent death in my tummy. Ooh. So. Oh. Okay. Sorry. Well, maybe we should go ask some friends. Yeah, let's ask some kids. Yeah. Yeah, my lesson. Liber. I think liberation is freedom. Um. To me, liberation would be, uh, finally getting out of my shell. That's the way to sing out loud. Um, it's when everybody gets in a big band and they sing really, really, really loud. Liberation is when the saddle finally comes off! Well, the first thing liberation means to me is, is liberation prophecy to band. And then the second thing is that the Statue of Liberty, and the third thing is the Pennsylvania, the Liberty Bell in Pennsylvania. That's what li that what liberation means to me.